It is currently three in the morning. Uh, and Jada just woke up having like some some first contractions. Now whether or not this proceeds into something more, we don't know. Um, but as of right now, I think that's what's going It's just starting out. So I just wanted to get the whole thing from start to finish. So that's what's going on. So we'll see what's, what's happening. later I'm gonna go load up the car okay. I need you to track your own contractions mm -hmm. all right so two hours in and we are headed to the hospital they are probably gonna check her it's so crazy that we're actually having a baby like it's so hard to have like excitement right now because right now it's like go time I'm not really thinking too happy I'm like man that's really unfortunate that my wife is going through what she's going through but I don't know we're gonna head over to the hospital we're gonna check her we're gonna see what's happening Sorry, they grabbed my ass. Mm. And my wallet. I couldn't mm. find my wallet. Tell you what they say. Love you. Josh will be careful. All right. Foggy, okay? I will. Mm. Make sure you. I, I'm I already did. I, I know I'm standing in the driving, so. I can't even see. Oh, yeah. mm. For women? For women. Yes. Right next year? Yes. Okay. Hello, this is Joshua Overton. Uh, I called around 4 o'clock and uh, we were trying to get a hold of the, a nurse or doctor. Uh, our doctor is Dr. Kalnick um, and she's on call in labor and delivery right now. Uh, no, she she called us, but she told us to give her a call um, whenever we were decided to uh, head into the hospital. And I think we're going to go in and try to see how uh, if there's any progression. Got it. Okay, so you're about to head on in. Yes. Okay, just to double check, are you guys at 816 Yes, that's my number. Okay. Now I'm going to send this all in. I'll let her know. Thank all right. you, sir. Thanks so much. All right, bye. No, here. This is where. This is where Ashton said that they came from the front door. Oh, 
coat on. Is it starting? should be here really soon we're hoping we're really excited it's so, it's so hard to do this and be with her so that's why I haven't been getting too much but she's she's doing a really good job she's doing a really good job she's getting close to almost ready to push so so now at this point I feel more comfortable doing more of a birth vlog she was at two centimeters and the nurse recommended that we walked. And it was a lovely nurse. And when I say a lovely nurse, her name was lovely. Um, and she recommended that we started walking. And when we started walking, we progressed from two centimeters to six centimeters. So it was happening really fast. Um, and so labor probably started around 2.30 in the morning. And then we got to the hospital around 5.30, so we tried to labor as much as we could at home. And then we decided to come in and they checked her. She was only at two. And then we progressed to six. And now she has her epidural, so she's feeling more relaxed, right? Yeah, I'm having a contraction. Look at that. She's at a peak of a contraction right now. Look at the contraction. That was just the contraction right there. And she didn't feel it. <laughs> everything's happening naturally. Yeah. It's just I can't feel it. Yeah, <laughs> basically everything's happening naturally. Well, that's scary. Yeah. That's, that's scary. Yeah. But. Yeah. I'm glad you're not. I hate that you're doing that shaking. Yeah, so like yeah, I said. That's annoying. The shaking is annoying. Water broke. Crazy. Are you having a Baby's going to be coming soon. No, but that was intense. Yeah. But. I really do think I could have done it. I know you If I was done guaranteed, it. like, do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, if I was at, like at like an eight, I think I would have toughed it out. I was progressing a lot though. You were. You could have progressed more if you stood up and walked. But I, just couldn't get through it. I know. You know, one of the things was is that I just felt like I was gonna throw up the whole time. I can't stand that. Yeah. Oh man. So. Take my mask off now. <sighs> Doctor's supposed to be coming by soon, and uh, they're gonna be giving us kind of the rundown, just saying hey. And so it's exciting. But when her water broke, I don't. I know I previously mentioned that, but when her water broke, that was crazy because you heard it on their monitors that they have, and then she felt it, and then it was like. I think my water just broke. And then I, was, I looked and I was like, cause you expect like, <laughs> I don't know what to expect, but, and then the nurse came over and checked and sure enough, water's, water broke and it was nice and clear. So that was good. She's drinking a lot of water. What's wrong? So, hopefully we have this baby soon. I wanna see the baby, I wanna hold the baby. I wanna be a dad. I'm excited to be a dad. You excited to be a mama? Yeah. It'll be fun. So man, I'm surprised my hair looks this good. I slept, woke up, didn't do nothing to it. It's all curly. It's not all straight, pointed out or not. Looks like I actually, you know, decent. It really is decent. I can't show you the same for me. I didn't even look at myself. You're fine. Did you bring a headband? Did you pack a headband? Yeah. Okay. I think I did. I'll check. All I have to do is stop the headband on you. Look cute. Get all those. Thank you. Yeah, I can tell. Get all those prenatal flyaways down. But, uh,. I'm thinking, here's the thing, I'm thinking a girl. I'm thinking it's gonna be a girl. She's thinking, she doesn't know. She says she doesn't know, but she wants a boy. 
I just want a girl first. It's not that I don't want a boy. I just want a girl first. So we'll see. I put it on camera, but this is before birth, obviously. And so we'll see. I've stated my opinion. We'll see who, it doesn't matter who's right or wrong, as long as we have a healthy baby at the end of the day. But it'll be interesting to see if we have what we have. So it's the guessing game we play. Okay, well, until something new happens, I'll keep y'all updated. Practice push. Yeah. You do practice pushes. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know there was a practice. I thought it was just when your number's called, you. When your number's called, <laughs> you just go for when it. When they say number 10, you get into the game. Dr. DeGrand said she would come in soon just to like say hi. But... Is there, is, can you get over 10 centimeters? Or no. No. 10 so centimeters. centimeters is just your cervix is gone. Oh, okay. Yeah. And baby's head is able to come through. Oh, gosh. Can you, did you feel when I checked you? No, nothing. Oh, wow. I was a little surprised. Oh, good. Okay. Nothing crazy. Oh, wow. Can this thing come down? Does she need this up? So it can come down as long as you will be there to I'll make sure here. she doesn't roll out. So I'm going to be right here. This is, this is where I'm staying. I can't look at it. I'm sorry. Uh, I'll, as much as I want to not see, see yeah, kind of thing. It's okay. It's okay. I'm just here for you. Okay. Yeah, that's what's, that's what's important. Either start pushing or let her labor down. It's completely up to you. Would well, you have a preference, Mama? With Do you feel like you want to push yet? Or do you want to let some time go by, let gravity? Either way is totally. Yeah, I don't really have the urge to push Okay. Yet. Okay. Yeah, I'm let's let you rest some. Then let's wait. Yeah. Yeah. Because I mean, baby has been doing okay overall, I think, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. His head's not going to be like weird, or his, he or she's head's not going to be weird from being like in there longer in this work. No, I mean, the head, regardless as it comes to the birth canal, is might have a little different shape, but it will go back to normal in like a day or two. Okay. Mm -hmm. But I think, you know, let's wait a little bit, if, you know. And so how, I know you, this baby is a surprise as far as gender. How do you want to do the announcement? Are you going to look there? Are you going to look together? Do you want me to pull the baby up? How do y'all oh. envision this I happening? I didn't even think about that. Yeah, so. we got to get you a moment here. <laughs> moment would be like, baby comes out. She can like slide it like right here where she can't see yet. Okay, and I'm just like, I'm right. And then. <laughs> what do you think it is? I think it's a girl. Okay. So I'm gonna, we're gonna slide baby out. You're gonna look, you're gonna tell. Yeah, I'm here though. I'm not looking down. Okay, so we're, you're gonna look, and yeah. then baby's gonna come to you. Is that correct? Oh correct? yeah, right, okay. right on. Okay, flat, right there. Like okay. Flat, like. Well, she might, or he may not be that hungry right now. Yeah. For a second, okay. give her a little. Break. <laughs> <laughs> but so I'm gonna, we're gonna go. You're gonna seal. You're gonna tell her, and then we're gonna get her or him. Yes. Right to. Exactly. Now, do you think it's a boy then? I, I don't know. You don't know. She okay. wants a boy. She wants yeah, a boy. Yeah, he wants a boy. But it's okay. It's gonna be a beautiful girl that looks just like her. Oh my gosh, you're oh, actually cute. So we're going to. Baby. Okay, so really quick, I can't record the actual pushing, but baby is coming. It'll be here just after 10, a little bit over 10. Okay, all right, so that'll be uh, the update. So next. The next part of this is going to be y'all seeing the baby. All right. All right, so baby is here. I'm not sure if I've updated y'all yet, but it's almost one o'clock. Time has been flying, okay? So baby came at 11.14. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say, it's a her. We have a baby girl. Uh, we don't know what we're going to name her just yet, so we have some options, and uh, we'll figure that out. But She's doing good, she's healthy. Um, she is actually right now feeding, so that's really good. Jada now eating, um, whatever she wants. So, to fill you guys in, Jada had gestational diabetes. So, to limit the effects of it, she had to manage her diet. And so now she's able to eat whatever she wants, so that's good. But I'm gonna give you guys a glimpse of this beautiful package here.
Tesla. Soon y'all will be seeing baby in the car seat, in the car, going home. So that's what we're looking forward to. All right, so I may be a little bit ahead of myself here, but we're about to get the car seat out of the car and take baby home. Yeah, so we're really excited. I'm about to get this car seat here, up there, and then we're gonna hopefully soon. I don't, I'm always ahead of myself. I just wanna get out of the hospital and just get home, you know, and then, so it's, 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 it's one of those things, just being patient and trusting everything, the process and whatnot, so. But after all that being said, just wanted to update y'all. Everything's going well. We're so happy. We're ecstatic. We're so happy. I'm so proud. Uh, it's more more than proud of Jada and Olivia being uh, the father and husband, being able to just witness what I witness. It's, it's life changing. It's incredible. And um, wow. I haven't even really sat down and thought it's just been like okay respond 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 but like just being able to think about like wow everything that's transpired within the last 48 hours um do I have my phone on me because let me see what time it is okay so an hour and 10 minutes Olivia will be officially two days old so um but yeah, so it's just, it's like a sigh of relief. Everything, God had everything under control from the very beginning to end. And we were able to, um, able to see just God's hand at work in all of it, making sure everything was good. Um, I wouldn't be making this video, um, if it wasn't just for memory's sake for ourselves and, uh, I know that we have, being in the Navy, we have a lot of family that isn't around where we are, and they kind of probably want to be a part and experience this. So this is for them and for those of our close friends um, and anyone who's watching that just, you know, is a part of our lives and wants to know, like, what's going on. And so, so we're, I was excited to be able to be in, and this may not be as, uh, detailed as possible but because i wanted to be in the moment and this wasn't about just the the hoopla i guess you could say of of vlogging but it was about really capturing moments that i feel like will bring back memories capturing pictures as much as we can i know for myself i'm just so forgetful and i don't want to forget anything so um having this well, definitely, like, we can look back and be like, okay, well, this is what the nurses were saying. This is what the doctor was saying. And um, and then be able to show Olivia one day, like, hey, this was you. This was you as a baby. And this was your young parents, you know, because time is just flying. So already, I mean, honestly, it's weird because it feels like things have been going so fast. But at the same time, I feel like we've been in the hospital for like a week. So it's like, wow, we need to go home. And like, that's, I think that's when time will kind of start slowing down a little bit. At least I hope. Um, yeah, but she's doing well. Everything's good. Blessed. Highly favored. Um, so, yeah. That's the update so far. I'm going to get this car seat upstairs. And hopefully the have some news of us getting out of here soon so so good news is as I just got up here as I was walking into the room I guess I wasn't ahead of myself and baby is being Oh, not baby, <laughs> we're being discharged. So we can pack up all of our things. Baby has to feed one more time before we leave. And then baby and us get to go home. All right, y'all, we're leaving. We're headed home.
Huh? No, I took it out. Day. <laughs> Dawson, hey, your sister's home. 